Hey guys, how you doing? My name is Robbie, and this is my I really just did that. Now I gotta clean all that up. And this is my craft corner. And today we're gonna be trying some fun life hacks and crafts by 123Go. Down in the comments down below, tell me who you like better, 123Go or 5 Minute Crafts. This should be interesting. Anyway guys, let's do this. Cut out a print, spray the front of the print with perfume. Fill a small bowl with water. Place the print face up in the bowl. Wherever you choose to place the tattoo, spray it with perfume. Place the print face down, spray the top of the paper. After a minute, go ahead and lift the paper. That really does look real. Okay, which one do I want? Yes, this is art and print. Come on, you got this. Why are you working? Okay, just change the ink cartridge. Please work for me. You can do it. Do it, do it, do it, do it, please. Oh, a red button of death. It took the paper. It took the bait. Please work, 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 please work. You can do this, champ. No! What is wrong? Dude, I hate printers. <laughs> oh my god, I think it's doing it. It did it! Oh my gosh. It's beautiful. It's perfect. I love it. Let's go make this into a temporary tattoo. Okay, there it is. Now I just need to get some perfume. Uh, I'm gonna go ask Tori for some. Okay, here's some perfume that Tori gave me. Ooh, it smells like Tori Dabransky. But before we do that, we have to cut this bad boy out. Okay, yeah, don't need that anymore. Let me go ahead and spray it with perfume. It's pretty wet. Then we get our cup of water. And then it said to put it in here for about two minutes. Okay, I'll see you guys in about two minutes. I'm gonna go wash off my hand because it smells a little too much like Tori. Okay, it's been about two minutes. Then I go ahead and spray my arm. Looks good. Now we gotta get this bad boy out. And then we put it face down. Oh man, here we go. Yeah, not bad. Okay, and we just go ahead and spray the top again. I'm just drenching it. Yes! And we have to make sure, oh my gosh, Tori's perfume's a little sticky. Just kinda hold it against there for about a minute. Oh man, I really can't wait to take this bad boy off and see how it turns out. Okay, I let it sit for about a minute. Uh, let's see how it turned out. You guys ready? And... Dang! It didn't come off at all. I wonder what happened. Why don't you want to come off? Dude, it didn't work at all. I wonder why. Well guys, I guess we're gonna have to say that this one doesn't work. Dang, that sucks. I kinda wanted a temporary tattoo. Ugh, oh well. You'll need a straw and some scissors. Flatten out the straw. Cut diagonal slits at the end, continuing most of the way down. Be patient. It may take a minute. Stick that sucker in the drain and pull it out. Hair and all. A clear drain is a happy drain. Oh, okay, guys, so the first thing we're gonna need are some straws. Save the turtles! Don't worry, Koopa. I'll save you from these evil straws. They'll never hurt you again. Oh, here we go. Then we grab our scissors. I only really need one straw, so uh, get out of here. Oh, this straw's broken. Can't use that one. Yeah, perfect. Actually, I want the yellow one. Yellow's better. So then we just kind of uh, do this. Cut like that. But first we have to flatten it. Oops, I forgot the flattening part. So we're flattening it. Then we just go like this. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Okay, yeah, we got some little hooks on here. Let's go and try this out on the shower. Okay, guys, here we go. We're just gonna untwist that. Yeah, there we go. And then we're just gonna put that down there. And hopefully, we'll get some hair. Oh, come on, you got this. Okay, ready? And we're gonna try and pull this puppy out. I didn't get any hair. Oh yeah, I forgot. I just cleaned out my shower. Dang it, this is a bad time. Come on, there's gotta be something in here. Wow, this is anticlimactic. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and try this with another shower. Dang, it looks like this one is clean as a whistle. Oh man, and this one is too. Let's see, do you have any hair in here? Oh, there's a receipt. But it's still freaking clean. Guys, I did not see this coming. Okay, there's only one other option. I have to clog the drain myself. Tori Dabransky, do you have any extra hair that I can use to clog the drain? How do you clog the drain? I need to clog the drain with hair. I need to the drain Tori Dabransky, I need to clog the drain. Can you help me? I just need you to cut off some of your hair. Well guys, I really didn't see this problem coming. The problem is, I don't have a problem with my drain. And that is a problem for my problem to be problem solved. <sighs> well guys, I guess we have to say that we don't know if this would work. Unconclusive. I feel so lame! I should have thought of this! What am I doing with my life? I'm sorry guys. I failed you. Place the torn pair of pants on a table in front of you. Find the corner sticking out. That's the crotch of the pants that needs mending. By making this rip even bigger, you can now place your entire head through it. <sighs> okay guys, so here's my sweatpants, and ironically enough, I did have a pair with a hole in the crotch. How convenient is that? Okay, so the first things first, we need to fold this puppy 
in half. And boom. Then we get our scissors. I actually have a cover on these because they're so sharp. Just kidding, I didn't cut myself. Anyway, they just went like this. It looks like they just straight up cut the crotch off, so I guess I'll try that. You ready? Okay, let's hope I didn't make mistakes. And, oh, I think I might have done it. I think I did it correctly. That looks about the size of a, a t-shirt hole. Let's go ahead and try this puppy on. Okay guys, here we go. I'm just gonna, I know I'm gonna look ridiculous in this crop top, but it's fine. Actually, that's almost not a crop top. Not bad. I'm kind of digging this, actually. Wow. <laughs> it still has a little string. How funny. I bet Tori would actually like this. I'm gonna show this to her. I'm going to Bratsky. I have something to show you. What do you think? Come in. Are those pants? Do you like wearing your crop top? Pretty good, right? Do you Pretty want, good. Do you want to try it on? Sure, I'll try it on. Okay, guys, I'm gonna have Tori try it on, and we'll be right back. <laughs> Whoa, Tori! You look great. I look great. Do you do you like it? I like it. It's fun. And then it's can... fun and it's hip and I feel cool and warm. Do you, do you want it? No. <laughs> oh, you could even wear it like a little bit off the shoulder. Yeah, there you go. I could tie my pants to my shirt so I don't get lost. Or... You can tie it to me. Oh my goodness! There we go. There we go. On now the I leash. won't lose my pants or my boyfriend. Anyway, guys, I guess we're gonna have to say this one works. It looks pretty good on her. Pretty good. Tori, I think you should wear this outside. No, it's too cold for it that. It looks pretty good, but it's a sweater. It's like barely a sweater. Okay guys, so first things first, I gotta find out where I put my darn stapler. I can't find that darn thing anywhere. Oh, here it is. Perfect. Okay, yeah, this one ought to do. So we just gotta get a staple out. So just, uh, and I accidentally squish the staple. Oh man, uh, I can staple this. Haha! -ha, I've done it! Now I just have to try and round this out. Here we go. Maybe use two pens. I think I might need some pliers. Okay, here are our pliers. Just uh, get our staple and just kind of gently round this off. And uh, there we go! It's very small. Uh, I'm sorry if you can't really see it that well. Uh, let's try this puppy on! Okay, so here's our little piercing. I've never had a nose piercing before. I have had a lip piercing. You can see the hole really closely if you look. Is that is that too close? Can you see that? Wow, this focus is really close. Anyway, let's go ahead and put this on our nose. And ow! Ow! Take like the inside of my nose. I think we're gonna sneeze. Wow, I look pretty freaking cool with this. Maybe I should get a nose piercing for real. Although, I think I'd always be touching my nose because I can feel it and it feels weird. I don't know, do you guys think I should get a nose ring? Let me know down in the comments down below. But anyway, I guess we can say that this one works! Hold a chopstick in the same hand as the bottle and swiftly slam them down at the same time. Boom! Okay guys, so here's our coat. And I don't have any chopsticks at the moment, but I do have this big old grip of pencils. So, uh, uh, cl close enough, I guess. Okay, here we go. So just grip it like this, and then you put it in like, like, uh, like that. One, two, and... Oh! Okay, try it again. One, two, and... One, two, and... Nope. Ah! I'm just messing up my pencil right now. I really need chopsticks. Where the heck are my darn chopsticks? Okay, let's go ahead and try it with this Expo marker instead. Maybe that'll work, I don't know. Oh, it's a little short. It's kind of short. Okay, here we go. One, two, three. No! Ah! I almost dropped my camera. <laughs> Ironically, this Coke bottle saved it because it was holding the tripod. Oh my gosh! We can use a screwdriver. Why didn't I think of this? Okay guys, ready? One, two, and... It just blew the top off. And it got all over my camera. Wow. Well guys, I guess we're gonna have to say that uh, this one works. Time to clean off my camera. Ooh, oh no. Okay, so after some further inspection, it looks like I just broke the whole top off. Where did the top go? Is that, no. I actually don't know where the top went. So that means that there's just glass hanging out somewhere in my room. I heard it hit the ceiling. You can literally see, literally Coke on the ceiling. And it also got up here too. Uh, you can't really see it so well on this one. Where did the bottle top go? Well, let's hope I don't find it with my feet. Well, it looks like I'm gonna be wearing boots in my office for a while. Okay, so after watching that footage, I actually had Tori help me find it and it was actually right on this couch this couch that is all the way on the other side what the heck that is crazy it blew that far well guys i guess we're gonna say this one works there's even some glass still stuck inside the bottle cap that is so crazy 
Excuse me, I was using that pen. Well, now nobody gets it. This trick is super simple. Simply bite one end of the pen and push it with your hand. See how it falls out of Mia's mouth? Okay, uh, first of all, one, two, three, go. I like your shirt. Uh, wh where, where did you get that shirt from? It reminds me of a shirt that I have. Uh, you know, the one I'm wearing right now. How funny, we're both wearing gray pizza shirts. Uh, anyway, here's our highlighter. So what they did was they went like this. Oh, I almost got it. You could see it. Uh, right. Okay, let's try it again. Ready? One, two, and... Dang it! So close! Okay, so if you zoom into my face, you, you won't notice it. Ready? Dang it! I am really bad at this, guys. Oh, I got it that time! I... Except for that one little part, but I freaking got it! Well, guys, I guess we're gonna have to say that this one kind of kind of works. Just need some practice at it, just like everything else. <laughs> Add a little soap to your makeup sponge, soaking it in water like Amy's doing here. Pop it into the microwave and set the timer for about one minute. Once it's done, go ahead and take it out. After it's had time to cool, take the sponge out. Squeeze out any excess water it's holding onto. Okay, guys, so here's our beauty blender. This was actually yellow originally. Now it's kind of like a dark brown yellow. So hopefully this works. Here's our cup of water. Let's go ahead and drop that in there. Here's our hand soap. Just kind of uh, put some of that on there. Yeah, not bad. Now let's go ahead and toss this in the microwave. One, zero, zero. And start. Okay, here's our sponge. Ooh, hot. It's definitely taking a lot of stuff off of it. I don't even know how I'm gonna get this out of here. Burning my finger. Ah! Okay, I definitely have to wait till this cools down, I think. Ah! But look how clean it is. Is that one spot? Ah! Woo! Jeez. Dang, that is so clean. I just want to wash it off, but it hurts so bad. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and let this cool down a little bit and then we'll try it again. Okay, it's a little bit more cooled down. Ooh, still kind of hot. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's definitely cleaning off the, the sponge though. Wow. Dang. That's so much more yellow. Well guys, I guess we're gonna say this one works. Instead of a piggy bank, try putting your cash in a baggie like this one. Make sure you close it up tight so that no excess water can get to the money. This way you can tuck it right into the inside of the machine. And once it's tucked in there nice and tight, you can go about doing your laundry as usual. Okay, so here's our money. Here's our plastic bag. Put this bad boy in here. Cool, let's go uh, find our washing machine. Okay, so here's my washing machine. And I feel like if I were to put money inside of this thing, I would probably lose it. Let's try the dryer. How's the dryer look? Dude, there's literally no place in here for me to hide money. Well guys, I guess I'm gonna have to say that this one doesn't work for me. Whew. Okay guys, now it's everyone's favorite part of the video where we recreate the thumbnail! Woo! Okay, so here's our highlighter and we're just gonna I'll find that later. And we're just gonna go and color our lips. You ready? Oh my gosh, is this actually working? I bet this is terrible for my lips. Is this non-toxic? Please be non-toxic. Wow, it's actually coloring my lips. I feel like it's really bad for my lips though. Don't do this at home, kids. Wow, okay, so uh, my lips are actually pink now. Oh, uh, weird. Okay, I should have probably taken the first picture first, uh, but uh, might as well do this now. Okay, and uh, here we go. Okay, looks good. Now time to wash this stuff off my lips. Okay guys, thanks so much for watching the video. If you liked it, make sure to give it a thumbs up. It looks like this part right down there. If you guys like this video and you guys want to watch me do even more fun life hacks and crafts, I have a whole playlist that you can be doing them right here. If you guys are new, make sure to hit that subscribe button. If you guys want the shirt, some stickers, or any of my other merch, you can click right here. Okay guys, love you so much. I'll see you guys again real soon. Peace, love, and Wi-Fi. Okay, bye. Ah!